unfold in the another few days over to you hmm. all right mr ram shivastav sir uh, your take on what's happened to, to uh, sunita williams yeah. obviously she's prepped for that uh, before they left there uh-huh. is every eventuality that is covered but now if uh, elon musk is planning to have a colony on mars by 2031 uh, there definitely have to be uh, you know uh, recourses related to this kind of a situation yeah exactly all these conditions have to be taken into care the reason is very important ultimately we have to go to the mars and outer space um it will be a long journey for months together in that particular case the data obtained from uh, uh, the sunita bilam and uh, her partner will be very useful one more important thing of this the scientists are worried because of the experiments done on animals it has been found that after a long stay in space in zero gravity uh, particularly the edema in the brain takes uh, very serious condition um, but i am sure this is not going to be the case with the um, sunita bidam and will uh, uh, more the reason is they were doing regular exercises and uh, particularly sunita bidam was uh, uh, trained extraordinarily for uh, the yogic exercises of the breathing and uh, Uh, other exercises so i am very much sure that she will be perfectly okay these are the extreme conditions because uh, loss of hearing dizziness uh, nausea getting faint these are the uh, extreme conditions of long stay in zero gravity but here in this particular case there are so many possibilities one is the s a n s that means the space flight Uh, associated with uh, uh, neuro ocular syndrome uh, that is uh, very serious if it is there uh, but uh, the regular monitoring was being done over there uh, bill more as well as sunita william so chances are very rare but still we have to be prepared for that and if such type of any side effects are taking place because of the fluid in the brain is developed much in that particular case how to treat how to um, uh, first thing is to monitor them they will have to keep it in um, quarantine and obviously baby feet is there not only this there might be psychological uh, conditions that can be easily changed they are very strong william um, was uh, in uh, navy so she, she was perfectly fit as far as uh, health parameters are concerned and uh, will more is also there but uh, the important thing is uh, at 2:47 uh, am of local time of florida they have joined the crew uh, four members of crew 10 has entered and they are enjoying at this particular time when we are talking and uh, now uh after 3 days uh, the four people will come of the crew 10 will come and this 70 uh, 72nd uh, mission is very successful and undoubtedly in the new crew one japanese astronaut is there one russian is there uh, and um, uh, the uh, crew 9 uh, will come back and this will uh, this is already added there Uh, so uh, during this time there are so many other parameters uh, uh, one is very important the effect of cosmic radiation which is uh, very there uh, nowadays a, a strong beam of cosmic radiation is coming from the unknown sources uh, of the space uh, the effect is to be studied in detail because if uh, they are as uh, our expert has said that uh, genetic changes are possible that means it may cause to the cause um, malignancy so those all parameters are to be sorted out and i'm sure that in the next mission uh, with the experience of long stay of sunita bliam and uh, bujmilmo uh, will help spacex 
for its planning in the future Mars mission. And other thing is that ultimately we have to uh, establish one colony over the moon and that uh, requires uh, very precise information regarding the impact of the solar radiation because here our atmosphere is acting like the skin on the body. So a very high radiation sometimes coming from the solar wind. They are not <coughs> being affected they are being uh, stopped there by the magnetic field around the earth the magnetic field effect on the human body is very very important and on the moon if we are going to um, develop colony moon colony then uh, what will be the long term effect of the solar radiation that is also very important and that can be um, very well studied uh, in the future planning of the international space station undoubtedly the life of the international space station is now limited uh, it is losing its orbit regularly so the time has come it is to be expired uh, after some time and uh, the alternative what to be uh, studied. Meanwhile, I am very much sure the data of the Chinese space station will also be shared because of the international uh, agreement as far as the use of space is concerned. And uh, we are in India, uh, we are also planning to have our own space station and whatever information data sharing is done with Sinita William and Bill Moore, that will also be helpful for us because we are very recently preparing ourselves uh, and we are successful in uh, docking and de-docking okay, experiment. Sir. Let, of, me, uh, let me also uh, open Mr. P.K. Ghosh into this conversation. Mr. Ghosh, yeah. obviously this is a testament to the planning